Hello and welcome to another video on AnyNode. We invite you to sit back and watch as we show you how easily you can use AnyNode to configure your own sounds and your own music for when calls are on hold. In practice, it so happens that PBXs can't play music on hold or tones. Even Skype for Business desktop phones will not play ringback tones. For cases where calls are on hold, AnyNode offers the ability to play audio from media sources in the appropriate node. So, music can be defined on the node to the outside line, and then the caller who is on hold hears music played. It is always necessary to choose the node on whose side the caller should hear music on hold. By default, the use of media sources is disabled, so they need to be enabled first. AnyNode already provides country-specific dialing and ringtones for use. The list of media sources starts with the most important sounds. The drop-down list contains the available tones. Dial tone. The dial tone signals to the caller that the node's ready to receive the telephone number digits. Proceed is the tone for transmitting calls. Ring, ring back. With a dial tone, the caller gets to hear music in the call phase parallel to the ringing tone. And of course, there are also settings for the music on hold. Underneath is the block for the tones when errors occur. Here, for example, the signal tone for the busy signal can be set. If you set a tone here, the call is always accepted and then a sound is played. This, for example, can be great for an announcement, currently all lines are busy, assuming that condition exists. If the already supplied sounds are to be used, further setting options are available if required. We click on Add Media Source and can now determine the type of media source in the Media Sources Assistant. With audio media source, not only the volume or length of a sound can be defined, but also several different sounds are combined to a new sound. As an example, we select the US dial tone. And here you set the volume and duration for each audio segment. The audio segments can be assembled here if required. Finally, a freely selectable name is assigned so that you can easily find this media source in the list afterwards. Of course, you can also use your own audio files. We will show this with this example of music on hold. This usually needs to be set in the provider node because the callers should hear the music on hold when they are on hold. To do this, we select File Media Source in the Media Source Assistant. The audio file can be uploaded directly into any node since it is then managed from there and cannot be accidentally deleted if it is still used in a node. Only when the reference object of the audio file has been deleted is the audio file also deleted. Please note that only certain audio formats are compatible. The audio file should be waveform audio or WAV and if possible contain a Microsoft audio codec. The compatible sample rates are 8,000 Hz and the multiples thereof. For example, 16,000 Hz, 32,000 Hz, and of course, 48,000 Hz if very good sound quality is desired. We also want to point out that you should own the rights to the uploaded music or use royalty-free music. With Start Upload, 
the audio file is uploaded into any node. For shorter tunes, there is a repeat function. At this point, we can again assign a freely selectable name, which we can find in the list of music on hold files. Now, all we have to do is enable the forwarding of the hold state. To do this, we go into the routing forward profile of the routes and find under telephony forwarding the setting of the hold state whose forwarding is not activated here by default for reasons of compatibility. We activate the forwarding of the hold state. Activation must be performed on all routing forward profiles in which the provider node is involved. In certain cases, forwarding a hold state may result in the far end being unable to handle a hold and therefore result in a disconnect. In this case, you can disable the forwarding to the opposite side. We go into the media negotiation settings and set the view on the highest detail level. The corresponding setting can be found under specify the payload specific media negotiation. Finally, we would like to introduce the last media source type in the Media Source Assistant, Telephony Media Source. Here, audio will be made available by establishing a new call and using the audio of that call as the source. We would like to show this with the example of music on hold. First, we need to enter the node to be used for the call setup to the audio source. Then, it's necessary to specify the dial string of the destination address where the provider for the audio is located. As a practical application, one could then use, for example, an audio streaming service that offers different audio streams that can also be heard via a telephone number. This number is entered as a dial string in the destination address. The caller thus receives repeatedly updated and varied content for waiting music. Depending on the provider, it may take a few seconds for the stream to be established. Please note again, however, you should avoid any legal problems and not infringe on any claims of copyright protection. Now we've reached the end of this video. Thank you for your time and attention as we reviewed yet another reason to choose any node.